A terrifying commute home for some after a man with a gun hijacked a commuter bus in downtown Atlanta. One person was killed. The suspect now in custody following a high speed chase and much of it captured on camera. ABC's Rena Roy reports. An urgent investigation underway after police say a man hijacked a commuter bus in Atlanta. It started in downtown Atlanta Tuesday as the evening rush was beginning. Authorities say 39-year-old Joseph Greer hijacked the bus with 17 people on board, holding a gun to the bus driver's head. Hostage situation on the that bus. PD on scene. Our 911 operators trying to navigate what was a gunman with a gun to the head of a bus driver saying, don't stop this bus or else worse will happen. This is the type of thing that obviously no one uh, is, I mean, it seems like the movies. Footage from above shows the bus sideswiping two cars, causing others to collide as they tried to get out of the way. Johnny Gilbert got a call from his wife on board telling him one man shot another man. They hung up, scared the gunman would target her next. For about 45, 50 minutes there, I had no idea what was going on with my wife. Police say one passenger called 911, keeping the line open, which helped feed them information. After chasing the bus for about 40 minutes, police popped the tires, bringing it to a stop. Tires were balding on one side of the bus. As you see, it's leaning towards the right. So we were able to position our bear cut to keep it from moving any further, thus allowing the bus to be immobilized. Passengers exiting and SWAT team members moving in, taking the suspect into custody and finding one passenger on board was shot. That injured passenger was transported to the hospital where they died. Authorities say the suspect is a convicted felon with 19 prior arrests. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York.